Hi guys, welcome back. So today's video, I have got a double Louis Vuitton unboxing for you and something super exciting. It's also starting with L. So if you are new to my channel, hi, I'm Mel. I would love for you to join my family and all you need to do is hit that red subscribe button and don't forget to click that bell so you're notified each time I upload because I have a surprise coming up. So in today's video, let's get right into it. I'm gonna do it in reverse order this time. Let's start with the biggest box. So in this box, as you guys know, Melbourne is actually in lockdown. So this was sent to me. I actually have been holding out unboxing this because I wanted to wait for this video because yeah, I'm, I'm gonna show you guys something. But yes, this was, I purchased this on the 1st of August. So it's been sitting there just patiently waiting until today. So delayed gratification. So in here, so this was actually shipped courier to me because Melbourne, as I said, is in lockdown. So we're not allowed to go out. All the retail stores are closed. And in this fairly big box is a little tiny package. And it is just so cute. Can you guess what it is, guys? If you were guessing the Nice and Nano, you are 100% correct. I mean, look at it. It is so darn cute. It fits like on the palm of your hand. So I also brought down my Nice Mini just to give you a very, very quick comparison. This is not gonna be a comparison video or anything, but I just wanted to show you the size difference. So Nice Nano, then Nice uh, Mini, Nice BB, and then the biggest size niece, which comes with a strap. So this, to open it up, it is just tiny, guys. Absolutely tiny. So inside, it's just that. A lot of people have been using this as a bag. You can absolutely attach some straps. I've seen people do pearl straps, acrylic straps. You can embellish it however you want. It's just so darn cute. Make it your own, do whatever you want. You can make it into a crossbody bag as well. I'm not sure how, be, how I'll be using this um, yet, but it is very cute as a crossbody bag. And also I will always share price. So let me grab the receipt and tell you the price. So the Nice Nano comes in at 970 Australian dollars. So that is my very first reveal. I do want to say, this is my most asked question. If you wanted to use it as a handbag, it does not fit my iPhone 11 Pro Max. It's too, as you can see, it's not gonna fit. But if you have a regular sized iPhone, it will fit, just for your reference. But these sort of cute, adorable mini bags, it still will hold, it's not supposed to hold a lot, but it definitely will hold all your essentials. Okay, so let me just put this cutie here, just for some eye candy. And why did I hold off unboxing this? The reason is because I have got something that I love, something that is luxurious and something from a brand starting with L to show you. I'm so excited. I've been working on it for months and I am thrilled to let you know I have done my very first clothing item. And of course it had to be silk because I love silk. So it is from Lily Silk. You guys know that I've worked with them for ages. So many of you have given me awesome feedback about their shirts because they're so affordable and they're luxurious, as you know. So I own a lot of their silk shirts, but one thing that I always wanted, which they didn't have in their range, I had asked them about. And then they said, Mel, why don't you kind of like make something your own. And I was like, I would love to. So all transparency, this video is in collaboration with Lily Silk because I co-designed a shirt with them. So at the moment, Lily Silk have their 10th anniversary sale. So they've got heaps and heaps of offers. Their best-selling two shirts is this one here, which is called the Concealed Plucket Shirt. And number two, their bow tie silk shirts. And they're really great for the price. I have paid three, four hundred dollars US for silk shirts before. These are like a third to a quarter of the price. So you guys know I already own both these shirts and I love them, but you guys also know I love green. So this shirt here, the one that I'm wearing is 
the Mim two-in-one silk shirt. So I just want to go through it really quickly because I know a lot of you love silk like me and a silk blouse, you can wear it on the weekend, you can wear it to work, you can, there's just so many ways of wearing it. So what's different about my silk shirt? So one, this silk shirt is a two-in-one. So like their best-selling shirt, I wanted to keep it simple so you could wear it just plain like this with the concealed buttons, but I had to add a little bit of a Mel touch. So what is the Mel touch? And just on the, as you can see on the cuff here, I've added three pearl buttons. So I actually had to get Lily Silk to source this because I just think it just adds that little bit of detail. Also, what I did was with the sleeves, it's just got a little bit of a billowing effect, not too much because I didn't want it too exaggerated, but it just has that extra detail, a little bit of pleating and a little bit of billowing just to make it look that little bit more luxurious, a little bit more fashionable. I also purposely made the cuff like this, not only for this beautiful cuff detail, but you can actually adjust the length of this. So what you do is you actually undo the top buttons and you can actually fold it up, then redo the top buttons up and it takes the sleeve up about you know an inch. I think that's really great because it does cater for different arm lengths as well. That's something that I personally have found with some of my shirts. And thirdly, one thing that I love is being able to wear things different ways. And their silk shirts, none of them actually had a removable bow. I love their bow tie silk blouse, but you can't remove the bow. So in my version, it actually does come with a 100% silk. So this is made in the best quality silk, same as all their best sellers for those of you that do own their silk shirts. But this one here, you can actually wear it just like this. So you can just tuck it underneath here. So you can just wear it loose like this hanging, which I think looks really chic. Or you can have a much more formal look, just bear with me guys, and do the silk shirt up and then tie it in a bow. But honestly, when you have this bow, you can use it for so many reasons. You can use it as a belt, you can use it as a headband, you could even use it as a twilly if you wanted, the options are endless. So I've just tucked that underneath the collar. And as you can see, it looks really nice. So I purposely asked them to do this bow a little bit thicker because, you know, I saw a Saint Laurent and a Gucci one going for like 1,000 to 2,000 USD. Wow, that's very expensive. But no, I wanted to make this one affordable but still luxurious so that is what it looks like if you wanted a more dressier look and the price the price it is only 119.99 usd but with lily silk's anniversary sale on all their women's items if you buy one you get the second one 40 percent off and you can still use my exclusive code i've got the highest code among anyone because of the great relationship we have. So if you wanted to use my code, it's available on all their offers. It's MIM 15 off. And that entitles you to an extra 15% off once all the discounts come off. So how good is that? And I had to get this beautiful color. I got them to source that it's in this beautiful emerald green, Mel loves green, but it also comes in four other colors. So it comes in white, uh, it comes in the beautiful pale pink, it comes in black, and it also comes in the gorgeous red claret, which is perfect for fall, which is coming up. But really, you can wear it all seasons. And the great thing about this is that you can even just say you buy two, because it's buy one, get one second, second 40% off. You can, if you buy like a black one, you can also contrast it. So can you imagine this with a black or even a white? It would look so good. So you can mix and match however you want. So that is my exciting news that I've designed a new shirt. I, it's just exactly me to a T with the pearls, with the silk. So I hope you guys love it. I wanted something super versatile, something that I know I would wear 
and something that can take you from casual to dressy, from work to weekend. So that is my first Lily Silk blouse. What do you think? So if you were interested, I'll leave all the details down below. The Lily Silk sale does end in about three or four days. It's their best sale ever for their entire year, even better than their Black Friday sales. So do check out their websites. I own lots of their shirts. And if you wanted silk pillowcases or pajamas, everything on the site is on sale and my exclusive discount code still works on top of that. So, so next up on the second Louis Vuitton unboxing. So in here is a very, very popular item, which I've seen everyone sort of unbox and it's been sitting there for a month just taunting me, but it is another little cutie. Can you guys guess from the size of the dust bag? It is the ever popular and super adorable Louis Vuitton Petite Sac Plat or Sa Plat, I think in French, excuse it. I'm probably butchering it. But anyway, this has been so popular. It is oh, just another mini bag that is super, super cute. And that is what it looks like. Again, I'm not gonna be doing a review on this. If you were interested in a review, let me know. But it is tiny. It is a very structured bag. And this uh, petite suck plug, it's actually a reinterpretation of their bigger version, which is the suck plug, which is much, much bigger. So mini trends are still here to stay. Everything's almost shrunk to tiny, tiny versions. And you know, I'm a sucker for cute little things. So if you still like a structured bag, but the original Zach Platt was too bulky, then this is a good option. Now inside, this one as well does not fit heaps, but one of my prerequisites in buying a bag is that it needs to fit my phone. And yes, it does fit a bigger sized iPhone. So that's not a problem. And it also does come with a shoulder strap. So this bag, I kind of think I would wear it more handheld, but of course you love the option where you've got the shoulder strap as well. I have heard that some people say, oh, I think it's a little bit, it looks a little bit awkward crossbody, but personally, I think it looks pretty cute crossbody. The strap is not adjustable, but it kind of sits on an all right length for me. So that's, that's, so I will put in a mod shot of me wearing it. It is just so, so cute. Again, a very popular style. It comes in the monogram. This actually leather, Vaketa leather has been slightly treated. That's why it's not like stark white. And it also comes in epi leather, in the black and the pink. In terms of the price, which I'm going to tell you now too, the price of this in Australian dollars is 1,800. So it's kind of like below the $2,000 mark. As you know, everyone's having crazy price increases. So, I mean, by no means is it cheap or anything, but I think that it is popular because of the size, the price, and it's still, you know, very classic, iconic Louis Vuitton. I also brought down my Nano Speedy just to show you a quick comparison. So in terms of the size, it is a very, very similar size if I put it vertical, but this actually does hold quite a lot. So that's just a quick size sort of reference. Now I also brought my mini pochette, which is seriously one of my favorite SLGs. I think I use this every day. And I just wanna show you, it actually does fit in there. Not that you would just put that in because it'll take up all the space, but it does fit. So as you can see from the depth, it it is quite a thin sort of bag, but I think it is just too cute for words. So I wanted to put this cutaway in because Miss S and I are having a little play with my petite sack plait. And inside, as I said, it's very narrow. Let me just hold it up to the lights. Pretty narrow. And there's this pocket here. And Miss S can help me. I have this key clay and look, it fits in perfectly in this little slot. Do you wanna open this up a little bit yeah. here? Yeah, open it up, see? Look how cute that is. And also it looks so cute hung. So if we put this right here. Yep, and hold it up. 
How cute is that as an accessory? So, so cute. So I thought I would show you some other charms I have and to show you how cute it looks like embellished. So I've just attached the coin pouch from my multi pochette and that looks so cute as well. And then I'll get Miss S to take it off. And then let's try this one. Miss S can put this on. This is another charm I have. I think that's from 2016, maybe the Jungle Collection. That's just to put a bit of color on it. And okay, so the sun is coming in, but I'll just hold it up. How good does that look? Do you like yeah, that? It looks really good. It's just got a bit of color. Excuse the sun. And, but it does form a really nice shadow there. That could be a good picture. And then just really quickly for reference, so that is the Petite Sac Plot, that is the Toiletry 15, and that is the Mini Pochette. Okay, so since I'm playing around with my Sac Plot, I might as well show you a bird's eye view of everything I have packed. So that's tissues, this is a bigger sized iPhone, a card case, my Bastia mints. So it definitely fits all your daily essentials and then you still have space for some hand sanitizer, even another lippy. And in here, you can actually use it to store like your keys because it's supposed to be a key clay, but it looks so cute if you dangle it as an accessory too. So those are my two cuties that I held out and wanted to show you. And I also wanted to ask you guys that a lot of people have been saying that this is really hard to get and that's really hard to get, but something that is very usable for every day is actually my mini pochette. And I've, I don't know why, but I've got a lot of messages in this past couple of weeks asking me, you know, is there any tips on getting hard to find items? So I wanted to ask you guys as well, please vote below. If I could get this one here or the Damia Azure as just like a mini giveaway for you guys, what would you prefer? Let me know in the comments down below because you know, this is one of my favorites as well. I always like to share with you guys the things I love, I personally use. So let me know about that because yeah, I've got so many messages recently. So that is it guys. It was a quick reveal of my two little Louis Vuitton cuties. If you do have any further questions, do ask below, but it wasn't a review or comparison. I just quickly wanted to show you both those items and announce my exciting uh, collaboration with with Lily Silk with this two-in-one silk shirt. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for everything. I love you all so much. Please stay safe and I will catch you really soon in my next video. Mwah. Bye guys.